are the same ones killing black and Latino young people every day in America. Them police getting paid by taxpayer money. These people who want peace, until they're out of our communities, there won't be any peace in America for us as people. I'm the vice presidential candidate for the Green Party with Cynthia McKinney. Oh, We're not mentioned. falling for the Obama fucking hype, y'all. All right? Because Obama had them same police. Look at them. They ain't got no identification. Anybody who tell you. I'm trained with Malcolm X Grassroots Movement. I've been trained by National Lawyers Guild. They have no identifying badges on them. That's illegal right there. That's illegal. These are Gestapo police. This is what they did in Nazi Germany. This is what they're doing all around the country. And most of these young people who are police ain't even getting fucking paid money. But they get enough a little bit to stop the rest of us who will make their lives better. And there they go. No badges, covered. What kind of shit is that? They have become the military police in urban communities. That's what they're doing. Tasering young black and Latino people so they can prepare for what's going to be the internal war in America when this empire crumbles and people don't have health care, home care, nothing. The police are not here for the people. They're here for the government and to protect property. They'll protect that building before they protect the person. So as we say in the black and brown community, as Dead Press says, F the police, and we mean that. Look, me and Cynthia McKinney are running on the Green Party ticket. We need to get 5% of the vote so we become a major party in this country to stop the two-party system, as we call them the Republicans, the Republicans and the Democrats. What is the Green Party about? Livable wage, an end to the prison industrial complex, amnesty for all immigrants that are here, a stop to the war in Iraq, and a stop to the war in Oakland, California, and Flatbush, Brooklyn, a stop to, 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 to uh, getting into debt if you go to college. You shouldn't be getting into any debt. This is the richest country in the world. 1% makes more money than 150 other million Americans in this country. That's not a democracy. That's not a democracy. And the reason they need these police right now is so they can turn this in to a dictatorship and what we call an oligarchy. All they care about is oil, capitalism, property, and then they have these young people psychologically so brainwashed that these people will attack us, particularly people of color. Because they ain't going to attack no white babies or no white people, but they're going to attack all the people of color up in here first. But that's what the Green Party is about. And I'm not here just to get votes. I'm here to march with the people. I'm here to march with undocumented people that are getting harassed, with my Latino brothers and sisters that they're raiding. We started this movement in the 60s and 50s. None of these people be marching without the Black Panthers, the Young Lords, the feminists, the American. Fuck y'all if y'all are booing me. And keep it moving. I am that type of candidate that I will say that, and that's ignorant. If, you know, what, 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 I am that candidate. I don't care about cursing. There's what, a lot more things worse than cursing, like homelessness and, and young babies in America and Harlem not uh, having a lower infant mortality rate than babies in Bangladesh. What position do you think hip-hop can play in this political movement? Well, let me tell you change. what position hip-hop is playing right now. The hip-hop activist movement has been co-opted. And many of people that I was rolling with last year, who I consider great leaders, have been bought and sold by a foundation check. And that's what they do, because they see the power of hip-hop. They see how we fight against the police. They see how our movements are united. They see how within hip-hop, there's a multi there's a more, a more multiracial alliance in any crew than in hip-hop. I mean, I'm sorry, they're confusing me. What I'm trying to say is, Within hip-hop, there's a multiracial um, bed to that, led by black and brown voices. Now, either hip-hop is going to choose to get co-opted, become a grant, become a foundation, so that it could do this liberal-leaning stuff that you got police marching with you, you got permits and all that, or we're going to be the hip-hop radical activist movement that takes it back to the streets in every way. That's where we have to go now. So even within hip-hop, cats are going to have to make a choice. Are you drinking the Obama Kool-Aid, or are you going to be down with the people? I'm choosing to be on the side of hip-hop that's down with the people.